Road to GH will reveal how Tracy cannot believe what she has just witnessed. The video capturing Willow and Drew's betrayal not only enrages her, but also stirs a sense of disgust toward their disgraceful actions. Even though the incident does not directly affect her, Tracy fully understands that it gravely damages the honor of the Quartermain family, something she values above all else. However, instead of immediately erupting in anger, Tracy remains silent, calculating her next move with icy precision. She waits to see how Michael, as the one responsible for upholding the family's honor, will handle the situation. Will he have the courage to protect the Quartermain legacy, or will he let this scandal tarnish the family's reputation? Tracy waits, but deep down, she already has a plan if things spiral out of control. Tracy looks at Michael with disdain, unable to accept the weakness he is displaying. Even though Michael knows the truth about Willow and Drew, he chooses silence, desperately clinging to a marriage already tainted by betrayal. To Tracy, that means nothing. The only thing she cares about is ELQ, the symbol of the Quartermain family's power and prestige. In her eyes, this scandal is a golden opportunity to push Drew out of ELQ, and nothing would please her more than to see Michael take up the fight against Drew. Tracy's ideal scenario is clear, an internal conflict that would result in Drew's removal and her son, Ned, becoming the biggest beneficiary, solidifying his position within ELQ. For Tracy, everything is strategy. She cares little for feelings or personal losses, focusing instead on the bigger picture power, gain, and the absolute dominance of the Quartermain family. Michael may be weak, but if he acts according to her plan, it will still benefit her and Ned. Tracy does not waste time waiting. After careful consideration, she decides to act. With her usual caution and calculation, Tracy devises a flawless plan to make Drew pay while maximizing the benefits for her son, Ned, and reinforcing the Quartermain family's standing within ELQ. First, she sends a discreet message to Drew, requesting a private meeting at the Quartermain mansion. Drew arrives, unsuspecting, but as he steps into the room, he immediately senses the tension in the air. Tracy wastes no time on flowery words or emotional appeals. Her intentions are made clear through her actions. On the table, the infamous video of Drew and Willow plays, no commentary needed. The footage alone underscores the gravity of the situation. Drew freezes, his face pale as he realizes the peril looming over him. But Tracy remains unaffected by his emotional response. With cold, calculating eyes and a steely demeanor, she makes it clear this is no ordinary conversation, it is an ultimatum. In Tracy's mind, every move has been meticulously planned. She knows Drew is trying to run for office and build the image of a model citizen. This video would not only ruin his political career, but also disgrace the Quartermain name, something she will never allow. Using the video as leverage, Tracy demands that Drew immediately transfer all his ELQ shares to Ned. She has no time for empty promises. She wants results, and she wants them now. But Tracy doesn't stop at demanding the transfer of shares. She emphasizes that Drew no longer has a place in ELQ. She has already considered using both Michael and Ned to apply pressure, ensuring Drew cannot maintain his position in the corporation. With a series of calculated moves and unwavering resolve, Tracy orchestrates everything to leave Drew no choice but to comply. As she leaves the room, Tracy knows she has the upper hand. Her plan not only removes Drew from ELQ, but also paves the way for Ned's rise to power. For Tracy, this is more than a personal victory, it is a reaffirmation of her absolute authority within the Quartermain family and ELQ. She has turned a crisis into an opportunity, once again proving that no one can outmaneuver her in the game of power. Tracy does not wait long to see the impact of her threats. Drew, once confident and assertive, now sinks into a state of panic. Leaving the Quartermain mansion, he carries not only fear but also a sense of helplessness realizing that a single moment of weakness with Willow has brought everything he worked for crashing down. The images in the video haunt Drew, but what terrifies him more is Tracy's sharp-edged threat. It is not just his position at ELQ that is at stake, but also his political future, his greatest ambition, now crumbling like a sandcastle before the tide. 
Drew knows that if the video goes public, his reputation will be completely destroyed, turning him from a promising candidate into a public disgrace. The once harmless moment with Willow now becomes an indelible stain. Drew feels deep regret, but regret does nothing to undo the fact that Tracy holds all the cards. His career at ELQ is now entirely in her hands, and even his survival in the political arena seems uncertain. Drew not only feels the loss of his career, but also his dignity. He realizes he has become a pawn in a power game where Tracy is the master. Her cold, strategic moves have left him with no way out. A single mistake has cost him everything, his career, his reputation, and possibly even his future.